So this is a screenshot of us on a group call immediately after the news had filtered through that the uh, flight had been cancelled. Now the thing is, not only had the flight been cancelled, but it was rescheduled to Saturday, which is a full day and a bit after the original um, flight was due to land at Mallorca. So not wanting to miss out on a few hours, let alone a whole day and, and more, we all immediately got on the internet and started looking for alternative flights um, for us to fly out so that we didn't miss out on any any of the days um, that we had originally booked. Fortunately, we found a flight where all of us could um, be booked on at the same time. And it worked out that the flight was landing not, landing not much more than say, I think half an hour um, after the original flight um, was due to land. The only thing is though, the flight, the original flight was going to, was, was leaving from Gatwick Airport and um, we had a taxi booked to pick us up from Harvey Hills house to take us to, to Gatwick Airport because <laughs> not only was our flight cancelled, but early on in the week, we found out that the one train of all the trains scheduled, the one train that we were going to get from East Croydon to Gatwick Airport was also cancelled. Hence why we ended up booking a taxi. So we had to now contact the taxi company to take to get them to take us to Liverpool Street Station so that we could get a train from Liverpool Street Station to Stansted Airport, which is where the, the alternative flight the, you know, the, that we had booked was going to leave. Um, from so it meant leaving home an hour earlier than originally planned so none of us well apart from I think maybe one person um, got any sleep we ended up having to more or less get ready and leave out earlier than planned to go to Harvey Hill's house and get the taxi that was going to take us to Liverpool Street Station <laughs> Ah, oh, crazy. Something, something in this case is trying to escape. Look, look at the bulge on that. Look. The, the suitcase looks pregnant. Look. <laughs> Top of the morning to Uno and everybody. We are finally on our way to Mallorca. Where the water don't taste like what it ought to. <laughs> so we are at Liverpool, London Liverpool Street Station, waiting for the train station to open as you can see the barriers there closed off problem is the train is at 3 40 um, we don't know what time the station opens and there is a coach national national express coach leaving at 325 from somewhere around here which we could get but we don't know where to pick it up from because there's roadworks everywhere and we don't want to buy the tickets not knowing where we pick up the coat from so we're just sitting st well standing outside the station hoping that it's gonna the door is gonna open soon for what oh shame you're not buying your tickets 
Are we doing Wait, anything? Wait, yeah. the guys. Yeah, might as well. Take it off, yeah? Might as well. We're here now. Is it open here? Yeah? So the Train. Finally, on Not our way train. to Stansted. We were meant to be going from Gatwick. Gatwick. <laughs> what a thing. At 10 30, your no. flight. It was 10. Oh, no, it was 10 30, yeah. No, remember, it's 10 30. Oh, you're saying the text. at the, the text message? Yeah. Oh, okay. Your flight's cancelled at 10 30. Ridiculous. British Airways. Imagine if I go to sleep. 10 30. Oh my 10, gosh. 10, so, who 10, was, there 19, was, 10, yeah. was there anyone else? Was there anyone else that? was awake and got the message. Me, John. I literally was about to go, I, I had it copied and I went into the WhatsApp to paste it and, and then Harvey had already, already yes. put the flight. Guys, I was like, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I said, all so, I saw was, let me check. Let me check, let me get my phone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bloody, so yeah, are, you two gonna, are you two gonna sleep then? We would have wake up in the morning. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then we would have gone to Gatwick. And we would have been, no, no we would have looked at the phone at two o'clock or whatever time. Yeah. Yeah. Then we would have been like, yes. what? <laughs> I should have done it for. <laughs> 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 well, mate. <laughs> where, where are you going to? I don't know. Really? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, more of a deepest outfit. Oh, really? Oh, my God. She's a tick. Can you believe we're finally boarding the plane? Even though we've had drama after drama. Even seat change. And a seat change, yes. Yeah. So change. Yeah. we're not all sitting together now. I'm sitting on my own, like Billy, Billy, no mates. It might be first class. No, you can. I'm gonna sit in that single seat. Yeah, if it's an old seat, yeah, if it's an old seat. Well, we've arrived, but the drama hasn't ended. We're waiting for Harvey. Harvey was at the front. Yeah, we're in the right country. And he was at the front. We turned around. No, he's at the back. Don't know what happened there. So we just need to get our bags and um, meet Kareen and Ma Marvin. So Harvey Hills, they, they let you in the, they let you in the they country let then. They let me introduce some hills. <laughs> Baggage collected and there's Kareen and Marvin. We found out, oh look at that, we found our driver. <laughs> <laughs> Got to change that though. Change that to you. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's asking where the hotel is. 
Try like tourists, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Noisy neighbours. Noisy neighbours, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. We've got to put on some shots. We've got dinner anyway. I've got dinner anyway. What's the date? Are we having a chicken sandwich? I don't do nothing at all. After all the drama and shenanigans, we have made it. Wait, hold on, man. Let me get some pictures. Everybody running. <laughs> and uh, I think we have to say a, a special shout out to Harvey Hills for organising this, and then also to Joel for coming in clutch lastminute.com with the um, with the extra. What would you call it? It's not extra flight, is it? It's just the flight. The we have to book a flight, yeah, because our flight got cancelled. Um, BA flight, no explanation. And then we booked with Jet 2. And I must say, I've never flown with Jet 2 before. Have you got a problem with Jet 2? I fly again. I will definitely fly again with Jet 2. And lots of leg room, seat was comfortable. Was just noisy people on the plane. But we're here. When are we getting our bike? Today or Hopefully today. Hopefully today. Like, we'll go with the check right now. Okay, so we're going to get our bikes today. First ride tomorrow. We're we'll taking with you tomorrow. Our, our, our bounce back from the cancellation. We have been fed and watered. Well, I feel a bit but we're still hungry. And we're still hungry, but we're going to <laughs> have a look at the bikes now. Yeah. Us fish eaters, man. We should have had the chicken. We're going to go and um, see if we can see what bikes they're going to give us for tomorrow. <sighs> the name of the hotel where we're staying. So um, the store is on a siesta at the moment between two three. What's the time now? Oh, so yeah, they want a siesta till three o'clock. These are the bikes. Yeah, me too. Imagine having a house big enough that your bike has its own bath. Yeah, yeah, that's a physique. Is that a physique one? This is the Uh, so it turns out our bike shop where we're hiring our bikes from and not actually from the one at the hotels apparently it's a 10 minute walk away so we're heading there now we're just following dr google maps we're following following the human the human wahoo <laughs> me, 
Meow. No, 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 oh, video. Thank you. Thank you. Imagine that we 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 come to look for the uh, bike hire shop and look at one half of PPG is in his element because of this. <laughs> look at her face. Look at and there we go. Look, there's the other half of PPG. Look, look at. Look at the face. Here we go. We're not going to have to get them out of the shop now. They are going oh, to be in their sense. element. Oh, Finally, we're at the bike stop. Stop. Shop, rather. <laughs> Okay, so basically we were hoping to take the bikes away today, but um, um, because they were ordered specifically, not all of them are, are back because they're currently on the hire now. So not all of them are back and they're not going to be back till six. So guess what we decided to do? We're going to kill a bit of time and then head back to the shop to get the bike. Hey, have it. Get in. <laughs> Bit of the old carb of sangria going on here. Cheers, chin chin, all that malarkey. You're your element. Oh, <laughs> Tomorrow, elevation. That's not bad. One thousand. That elevation. What's that? Route number six. Number six. I honestly, I honestly That's a what? Miles. That's how many miles? Forty odd miles. Yeah, it's forty. Four miles. I honestly feel one thousand six hundred and would be a good ride. For tomorrow. Wait, tomorrow's Saturday, and then Sunday is Saturday. But if we start early, we can come back and go in the pool and rest and recover and replenish. Tomorrow. So, <laughs> why, <laughs> why, why are you giving side eye? Because I'm just like, I, I feel the lighthouse will be a good ride. Well, for tomorrow. Uh, for tomorrow. However, I would mean that we do Sakalaba on the Monday. You know, no. Like, no. No. I don't want to do Sakalaba on a Monday. Yeah, exactly. No, I want to, we have to do Sakalaba on Sunday. So we're trying to decide on what ride to do for our first ride tomorrow. We're going to do a, how many miles is it? 12 miles? 12 is too easy. That's too easy, isn't it? Yeah, it's too easy. I think, I think the number three, four. What ride, what one is that? Is that a lighthouse? Let's have a look. No, no that's not the lighthouse. So then it means that we have to do the Sinu V South Pobla. That's Route 6. So then we do the lighthouse after Sakalaba. We do flat, hilly. 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 Yes, yes. And then so we many... collapse on Tuesday. Then there's a spa in a hotel. Yeah, don't worry. Oh, so we this do is the, what I'm so we do the, the easy flat ride. So what, the 18 miles tomorrow and then Sakalaba or whatever on Monday. And so route number one tomorrow. No. No. Number six. Route number, no. You said number six. Route number no, six. No, but we said route number three, which is 18 miles and three, 375 elevation. Yeah, okay. That's no elevation though, you know that, right? That is flat. Yeah. Okay. Just okay, let's do that. So, yeah. route number three tomorrow, legs. which yes. is 18, 19 miles, Sakalaba Sunday, and then Lighthouse Monday. Yeah. 
and then just skin out on Tuesday like, before we go back to the airport. It's a warm up ride. If you're preparing for a longer day on the bike, or you're stuck in the sun, you can do that. Yeah. But you won't. <laughs> Sanka, you're dead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's awake. Look. So here's a man that's been um what is that? So he started off with a pina colada. Then he had a beer. Then he had a beer. He's had about how much sangria. Then he's had yeah, he's had a couple of glasses of the old I'm on holiday. Carva sangria. <laughs> now he's on the coffee. And now he's got he's on the caffeine. Yeah, he's still yeah, sipping up. <laughs> I'm on holiday. And we haven't even done our first bike ride yet. Yeah. But we have had no sleep. That's no true. Sleep. Yeah, that's true. We haven't we haven't slept since Wednesday, Wednesday night. Wednesday. Yeah, since Wednesday. Yeah. Thursday sleep. Thursday night there was no sleep. I blame I blame British Airways. Yeah, it's British Airways fault. Yeah. But um we're grateful to Jet 2 for getting us out of spot of bother. Yeah, we are, man. We're in the Pinarello store um, on our way to go and pick up the bikes again. And we just stopped off, done a bit of retail therapy. Got myself a couple of cycling, cycling caps. Picked up the Mallorca one. Joe. And I've got. Joe. Not that one, no. I've got a. That's Brooklyn. These two, these two are mine. This one, blue one, is for. Oh no, I was about to say Mrs. Bella. No, you're not Mrs. Bella. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that goes with um, that goes with Harriet Harvey. Are you recording? Because what I could do, I could use my other helmet. Yeah, that does look a tad small. It just looks like your hair looks like a coconut. No, then again, no. It's snug. No, I think that's all right. I like it. You don't want it too, like. YouTube, say hello to. Tanya. Mrs. Bello. That's Mrs. This is Mrs. Leon Bello, by the way. Part time Bello. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're back at the shop where we're hiring our bikes from. Um, hopefully they've got them here so we can ride back to the hotel, get them locked up. So after breakfast in the morning, we could just jump on the bike and do our first ride. So we've got our bikes. Well, some of us have, um, but we've got an issue with, uh, I think, two. Um, where they haven't got the bikes to the right size based on the information that we sent when we made the booking. This is mine, I'm giving it a test ride. Uh, seems to fit okay, it's a giant TCR. Uh, Shimano 105 mechanical. Don't ask me about the the gear ratio and stuff because that just goes right over my head. So, Houston, we have a problem. Kareen and Joe, they don't have a bike for them. So, all the information that was sent over by the bike hire company um, does not correspond with the bike that they have set up for them. So, they're trying to offer Kareen a small bike, which doesn't, it's not going to work. She needs a medium. Um, Joe needs a medium to large and they don't have that so dilemma don't know what to do but this is um, an issue for the 
bike for the company that we booked this whole holiday with. Um, Eat too much, and slowly the way Those of you who want to stop up, you throw those, you know what I mean? Just be careful of the coaches. The coaches are just like, they're very good drivers, but you know, it's just a jumping on, you know, when you've already got a small, like a road, you've got a shadow with a coach, it's just got to be easy. When you're on cleats, it's got to be easy. Mm. I mean, as long as you get the warnings and that, which we, they don't have any dramas here at all. Probably the safest place to ride a bike in the world. Yeah, I, I've heard so, in terms of like, the roads are smooth as well, is that right? Roads are like silk. Yeah. Did you not mind, that silk. We just come from England, Bristol. And man, we come out of the airport last night, I couldn't believe it. I said, look, look where we come from. Hot hole land. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. what it's like in London as well. It's crazy. Super smooth. And it's almost like someone goes out there and hoovers them in the morning. Mm. There's no stones, nothing in the mm. And at the moment, right now, you've got 20,000 cyclists on the island. You don't see nobody with a bunch of them. Mm. So, you know. And here, if someone hits you, if a car pulls out on you, they've got these guard or police, they just charge them over and say, look mate, the sky of cyclists is in the right, so this is a cyclist paradise. Mm. I mean, they've got to give you next time. Right? They've got drones watching the cars going around the bikes. So if they see a car that's got too near you, further up, they'll have the old bit of and just stop and they find one spot, that a couple of thousand euros. Yeah. But this is really safe place to cycle. Everything's in order, don't stress. Yeah. You've got, you got to have confidence in this though. That is important, yeah? I want to go home. <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord, we're having, second, we're having second thoughts. Don't know if you heard that conversation. I tried to capture some of it, but um, yeah, it's given us some food for thought. Not only that, we've got issues with the, with the bikes in terms of the bookings, so. We basically not got the bikes that we thought we were going to get. We thought we were getting um, bikes with our Tegel group set, and we thought we were getting bikes with you know, specifics to the measurements that we provided. Um, we've all got 105. Um, yeah, this is something we're going to have to take up with the company at a later stage. But. Yeah, it's it's not been a great experience so far. I mean, you were right. At least your flight didn't get cancelled. Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah, our flight got cancelled. We managed to get another one with another company as you seen earlier. But why are we waiting now? Who are we waiting for? Changing Joe's saddle. Okay, so we're just waiting for one saddle to be changed. And this as well because this is a male saddle. Oh, is it? Right, Karina's designed another route, so if it goes Pete Tong, no. it's Karine's fault. 